going on, everybody? This is Island Opera TV coming to you from Barbados. We're going to show you what there is to do on this island. Let's do it. Here we are now at Rock Beach. Rocky Beach, I should say. around 9 30 10 o'clock in the morning this here is pebbles beach and uh yeah you can see there's the hilton and the radisson nearby And now here we are at St. Lawrence Gap, which is a nice area to walk around and hang out. See, they've got several different bars here, Primo Bar and Bistro. It is around 4.30 p.m., almost five o'clock actually, uh, on a Saturday. Not too much going on just yet, but there will be a little later on. It's really cool because they've got the water right up against the road here. We've got the Church of St. Lawrence. So I'll show you guys around as we continue to walk through St. Lawrence Gap. McNaughty's. Abu restaurant. You can tell everything comes to life around six. Private car park. Yeah, so here we are at a great place to see turtles on the island. This here is Mimosas. And you can see right here in the water, ever so often, turtles pop up their heads. Today the waves are a bit choppy, but uh, still see turtles quite consistently. So this is called Mimosas, St. Lawrence Gap. Thank you. All right, guys, now we are at Animal Flower Cave. So it's a really cool cave. We go down there on a good day. We're going to check it out, see how this all works out. But this is mostly the northern part of the island, as you can see here. Get a nice view, and then we'll go down to the cave. You can either drive up here in a rental car, like I did, or you can take a tour and come up here.
Yeah. Was 800 pounds. Who? Oh my gosh. That was a tiger shark. From from the shore. So I want to do the catch up from up top. But when you get in the car, you have to go down on the shelf and bring him up. What year did they catch that tiger shark? Let's see, that was that was about a good thing from years ago. So there's some big ones in there. Oh, yeah. You ever see their fins? You're, you're talking about the sharks now, or are we talking about the whales? The shark fins. I tell you, we catch them. So, you mean know, like, and you see? Yeah, you ever see them, like, yeah, right here? Us, you could spot them for naked eyes sometimes. Oh, yeah. That's when they want us to see them. But they don't want us to see them all the time. Right. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, it goes right back inside that. It's a What do you want to do to you guys? There's people in the cement pool. The guy here, if you want to go out and we to take pictures. So Barbados is close to the equator, but it's still not the equator because that's down by Venezuela, I guess. So if you just jump right in there, it's pretty deep. You think so? That's the first thing, so we could get drunk pretty easily. A tsunami would get us in the wall. Good thing we don't get in there. All right. Here is my room. Okay. Got a pool there, no one's using it. And the beach. All right, it's sunset time here. So the area I'm walking around right now is called Carlisle Bay. And you can see, very nice, cruise ships are over there. People just out for a morning swim. It's actually 9 a.m. on a Saturday. It does connect to Pebbles Beach, but also several other beaches over here. So I'll pick up when I get to the crowds and show you what it's like over here. Look at this. Wave surfing. It's flat out there, but there's definitely some waves pumping. All right. The sun's coming in and out. Obviously the colors look better when there's sun but the uh, the weather is not as strong or the sun is not as bright on you when there's clouds because when the sun is out full brim fully blaring it's quite intense here in Bar Barbados because closer to the equator obviously Here we are now at St. John's Parish. So 
like they got some tombs over here. All right, guys, we're out here in Bathsheba. We're going to walk around this garden. Yep, Andromeda Botanical Garden here in Bathsheba. The woman who created this, she actually donated it to the Barbados Land Trust. What a nice lady. She brought so many different plants from around the world. At Bathsheba, there's lots of surfing here. You can see the surfers way out there getting some. Look at that. Those are some massive waves. Oh my gosh. Mega waves. Check out this cool beach though. Beautiful place. Yeah, how do you get in there? All right, so here we are at Joe's Bridge. The interesting thing about Joe's Bridge here is we have the Outer Banks film set. So that's something to keep in mind, but Joe's Bridge here is going over one of the few bridges or rivers that are in Barbados. They used to run the train over this. We are now at the Hunt's Garden. Very beautiful garden here. They say it's the most beautiful place on earth. Okay. Well, we're going into a cave here called Harrison's Cave. Chinese crew by the aid of a 955 kilogram caterpillar. Now, was that a dangerous operation? The answer to that is yes, it was. Things could have gone wrong. For five years and a few months to excavate a total of half a mile, which is the distance we'll be traveling today. But I don't think that a cave is a man made cave. No. It's a natural cave with a few man made tunnels. Because the cave is much larger than half a mile. The cave is over, over three miles that we know of. And it's why we connected to a. Wow! <laughs> that was not everybody. Let's try that again. Whoa. Wow! Wow! Yeah. 
grass. A hundred feet of height and a hundred and fifty feet of width. Ooh. Isn't that right, Andre? There's no children on board, sir. Tell the truth. But that's okay. He's actually telling the truth. He doesn't drink. So we can switch. That being said, right, okay, boy. And then you see the cluster formations at the back, right there. Doesn't it look like a pipe organ? And the rest of the spirodons can easily be the congregation, right? But Andre does not agree with that. Andre, what is he? Yeah, so they've got a waterfall down in here. <laughs> okay, here's a look at my room here. Got great views looking out towards the south. Thank you everyone for watching Highland Hopper TV. If you enjoyed this one, please consider watching another one of our videos. We have a recommended video and another video for you to watch next.